What I'd like to talk to you about now is about making provisions when we pass. It doesn't have to be a will. A lot of people think that will is expensive, but it's not. Check it out. Don't live on an assumption because when you've passed, you don't know what's happening. So you can control what happens when you pass and we're all going to pass away. So don't think, oh, what is Delia talking about now? Uh, I'm sorry, but you could just walk out tomorrow and a bus could hit you and that's the end of that. So make sure you've made the proper provisions. You could have made a will when you were about maybe 20 years ago, 10 years ago, but things change during that life. Do you really want to leave anything you have, whether it's money, whether it's a piece of jewelry, whether it's a house or land, to someone who is no longer in your life? What about the people who, who matter to you right now? You have to make sure at least every five years, every time a situation changes that you feel warrants that someone should get something or not get something, you really should do it. All too often, I have heard of people going into the deceased house and taking things, and then people can't find things. Don't let that happen to you. Make your wishes known. That's all for now. Give us your opinion. Make sure you use the address at the bottom, or take your phone, send us a message, and we'll post it here. Go on, do something. <laughs>